yesterday lecture on the meaning of criminology was more intrinsic, interactive, and even entertaining. Uh, more also, we we continue on another interesting uh, part of the meaning, the nature, and the scope of criminology. Today, we're going to be focusing on the scope of criminology, the scope of criminology. When you talk about the scope of something, you are inferring that is the extent of something or extent of the area or subject matter that the criminology deals with or to which it is relevant. So when you talk about the scope of criminology, we are talking about the relevancy of criminology. How is criminology relevant? Let me ask you, is criminology a relevant discipline uh, as it is today? So the answer is left for you. But I know a quite large number of people want to study criminolo criminology as a discipline, not because of anything, but because of the relevancy, because of the time we are, people have found out that crime is going nowhere. You know, crime has come to stay. The only thing we can do is to learn to live with it, is to learn to acquire knowledge, to avert some certain thing, to mitigate and to reduce the effect of crime on the society. And that is one, uh, pass, that is a perspective of functionalism. Uh, theory that states that crime is dysfunctional. Uh, we will go into that subsequently, but today we just want to look at the scope of criminology. Now let's look at uh, our point today. When you talk about scope, you also talk about the breadth of something, the reach of something, or the jurisdiction of something. So we are talking about the jurisdiction of criminology today. Lesson point, let's consider the nature, the scope, and you know, uh, of criminology. Criminology is an interdisciplinary field of study. I hope you know. Why is it an interdisciplinary field of study? Because criminology borrows from the work of various uh, professionals. Criminology involving scholars and practitioners representing a wide range of behavioral and social sciences as well as numerous no, uh, natural sciences. Natural sciences like uh, like chemistry, natural sciences like biology, these are, you know, uh, disciplines that criminology draws from. So let me put it in this manner. When we say they are interdisciplinary field of study, that means professionals from other disciplines also give their explanation why people commit crime or why people, you know, uh, why people exhibits criminal behavior. So that is the reason why is being categorized as interdisciplinary field of study. Uh, for the sake of time, let me quickly state it. That sociology or sociologists play a major role in defining and developing the field of study and criminology emerged as an academic discipline housed in sociology. This is the point. You now, sociology, uh, we can refer to sociology as the mother of criminology. Initially, even up to now, most universities are still, you know, uh, using sociologists to teach criminology, but times and, you know, uh, things have shifted. So now we now have a body, a, 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 a department, a, a criminology as a discipline on its own rather than being a, a subject under sociology as it were in, before 